what would it be worth to prevent Alzheimer's disease? My name's Robert Love. I'm a neuroscientist. I specialize in helping people prevent Alzheimer's disease with science. And I have some really exciting news for, me, for you. There is an exciting supplement that is shown to help prevent memory loss and even reverse memory loss in scientific studies. And I want to tell you about it. The supplement is called Aniracetam, spelled A-N-I-R-A-C-E-T-A-M. And Aniracetam helps prevent Alzheimer's disease in three ways. First, it protects the brain from neurodegeneration. Second, it works on pathways that help protect the brain. And third, it increases something called acetylcholine. I call acetylcholine the master molecule of memory because it is very involved in memory formation in the hippocampus. So aniracetam does three wonderful things that help protect the brain, reduce the risk of dementia, and improve memory. And it's even improved memory in double-blind placebo-controlled studies in adults with Alzheimer's disease. Those who took aniracetam, their memory loss stopped and actually improved by the end of the six-month study. The challenge is that aniracetam is rather hard to find. I spent about two months trying to find it. It was readily available in the United States, and then it became hard to find. A little history, aniracetam was a prescription drug in the United States. It, the, the patent expired, and now it's available without a prescription in the, in the United States. In Europe, aniracetam is prescribed uh, for Alzheimer's disease. So in Europe, you need a prescription. In the United States, you don't. I'm glad about that because I take it regularly, and I don't want to have to go through a doctor to get a prescription. The challenge is it's hard to find. And so I am conducting a study on adults who have either early stage memory loss or healthy adults to test the beneficial effects of aniracetam on memory. If you would like to participate, you can uh, go to the spot below this and you can check the comments and there and you can click there and that is a way to go there. Or you can go to the information below my name and you will see information there on how to uh, apply for the study. Now, this is a subject funded study. What does that mean? That means you, the subject, are asked to pay for your uh, study supplement. Uh, I, I choose to spend my time doing research and, and helping people, not writing research grants. And so I'm asking you to help foot the bill. It's only $500 per person. That may seem like a lot, that may seem like not so much, but wouldn't it be worth it to invest $500 of your own money to help contribute to Alzheimer's science? So if you are a healthy adult and you are not taking warfarin, please apply. In this study, you can find information below in the comments, and I look forward to helping you. Many blessings, God bless you, and what would it be worth 